What's up guys? My name is Cliff. Just remembered something. How annoying um, it can be to read the inner mouth of a character that you now you've already started, you've made your perfect character and you're struggling to make the inner mouth. So I'm going to show you a quick way how to do it. You need to your model to be mirrored. So turn off the mirror and have the cross-sectional view of the model so that you can be able to go into the mouth loop. And so the select the loop that um, of your character that joins the mouth. And then you are going to start to extrude inwards as you tweak um, the shape. It's basically just trying to get the shape of the inner mouth in, inside the human. So just follow along and you just tweak the mouth, the inner mouth. So I'm going to go slow and show you. Just follow the screencast and um, try to eyeball your own model so that you can get it right. It's really simple, but it can be annoying, especially if you do not, you do not have a, a mirrored character. So that inner space is very tight and so it can be really uh, tricky to get it right but it's very simple just extrude uh, ex uh, scale extend just adjust the shape till you get the mouth um, right just like that and just extrude Eyeball the shape, adjust it so that you can at least mirror the shape of the mouth. Try to gauge your own mouth or look at references. You'll see how the cavity is bent inwards as you go towards the throat. It's quite simple so just like that and then when you get it done I'll show you how to do the tongue the tongue it doesn't really take very long to do the entire thing but it really um, it's really important if you want your characters uh, at the end if you want to pose them you want them to look nice in your renders when you, when you pose them in an open mouth position uh, it looks looks good especially after you text it so just like that you can stop there but i prefer to go a bit inwards into the throat so that i can have that extra volume just makes it a bit more believable rotate Yeah, just like that. Make sure you have your clipping on. Otherwise, um, if you don't have your clipping on your mirror, the mesh is going to separate and it's going to cause you some headaches. Always be aware of the clipping. Whether you're scaling or you're moving, note the clipping, how the clipping behaves. When the mirror is turned on and off, it can cause you some real headaches when you're, <laughs> when you're rigging the character and you're trying to animate and it splits. Yeah, so as you can see, make sure the clipping is on and they are attached together. They don't separate at all times. And so when it comes to the tongue now, when you want to do the tongue, you just need to select a face and to extrude inside the mouth so that you can get the tongue also. All right. 
just like that and make sure that as you extrude the tongue make sure as you extrude the tongue when the mirror is turned off you delete the extra face i'll just show you rotate then delete that face because it's mirrored and you don't want a double face inside just like that and extrude again I was doing it slow so that I can show you the problems you encounter as you do this. And as a beginner, you do not need to go so fast. Just take it slowly so that you don't make uh, any mess that will just cause you more problems, more headaches. Yeah, so I decided just to turn on the mirror and to turn on the X-ray vision mode. X-ray vision. The X-ray mode so that I can just see rather than delete extra faces generated uh, inside the other half of the mirror. Yeah, and just continue to extrude the tongue like that. Extrude it right about there. I didn't really use a reference, so I, it's not, it's a stylized character, so it's not that big of a deal just wanted a tongue inside there and uh, smooth the vertices so that it doesn't look so blocky then we're going to add some extra loops so that we can get um, a more rounder tongue inside just like that you have basically got your mouth inner mouth and tongue uh, the foundation is laid now it's to tweak the shape of the tongue inside you just tweak the shape of the tongue just like that yep then you insert third face and press b to observe boundary and push it forward by pressing g then place a loop inside the mouth inside the tongue between the tongue once you do that if you turn on if you turn on the subdivision surf it will be smooth it will look decent then you can tweak as much as you want you can tweak the tongue yeah just continue to push things around inside the mouth eyeball it turn off the mirror turn it on so that you can get the desired shape but that's just the basically that's basically how you, you create a simple uh, inner mouth so I hope this tutorial was helpful to you. Um, hopefully I can, if there's anything, any other annoying issues I can help you with. Yeah, so bye bye.